How old is the universe? How old is the Earth? Scientific measurements indicate that the universe is 13.7 billion years in age and the Earth is 4.5 billion years in age. Yet many people see this in conflict with the Genesis 1 creation account, which seemingly t uh, teaches that the Earth is only 6,000 years old. Is this really the case? I'm joined today by Dr. Rodney Whitefield, who is a physicist and a Christian who is knowledgeable in biblical Hebrew to unpack these concerns. Uh, Rodney, in previous episodes, you uh, gave some reasons from the original Hebrew language as to why Genesis 1 is fully compatible with an ancient universe and an ancient earth. That is, uh, when we read Genesis 1 in the original Hebrew, it, it doesn't teach us that the earth is 6,000 years old, but again, uh, communicates the creation events in a way that is fully compatible with the antiquity of, of, of nature. What I want to ask now is, as a physicist, what are some reasons why you think scientifically the universe and the Earth are old? Well, the first thing I'd want to say is that I agree with uh, reasons to believe that the scientific evidence from astronomy establishes an ancient universe. However, uh, in talking to people that I've, I've interacted with, I have one person that I have talked to, and he says, well, I can't believe the astronomy because if you could do it by triangulation, I would believe it. And now we have reached the point where triangulation with um, telescope arrays can reach out far beyond 10,000 years. So that tells you in a, in a way that someone who is still a skeptic, that that has now been met. Now in my life, I, I lived in Eastern Washington and there was a flood at the end of the ice age. And I lived a lot of my life on the debris of that flood. Actually, it was a series of floods, which is now known, and we should have been able to see that earlier. But, but the interesting thing is that we can date that flood because you can date it by layers in the, the debris that has been put in lakes uh, after that time. You can count the layers. And that tells you that the, the Ice Age had to proceed about ten, more than that 10,000 years. So the planet Earth is now, a, a, just on what one can observe, and I have observed, it's more than 10,000 years old. 6,000 years doesn't cut it. As for the Ice Ages, there has been a series of Ice Ages. And we can go to Greenland and we can measure back hundreds of thousands of years. And we do this not by any sophisticated thing, we just bore holes and we count. Now we count very carefully, but 10,000 years isn't enough. Have you ever encountered scientific evidence for a young earth that you found to even be remotely compelling? No, <laughs> I simply haven't. 